Hello everyone! Welcome to day 3. Yesterday and the day before, we learned how to breathe correctly and not to breathe. Today, we will explore the upper belly. What you need is your fingertips and your belly and your muscles and your breath. So we will stand in the right position. And now it's time to breathe in and out. And in and out. Okay, as you know, when we breathe out, it's important when we keep it up that we don't breathe anymore. So keep your air, do the stretch here, don't breathe at all, and then we will tap our fingertips underneath our ribs. So not like this, like this. Really, really important, not... Yeah, okay, <laughs> don't torture yourself. We will start, inhale, exhale. Now I can't talk anymore. Okay, the important thing is that you need to learn to hold your breath for a long time because on stage when you've danced like three or four minutes before and then you will show what you can do in a drum solo and you're like <sighs> You can't do this, you don't have time Believe me, you need to do it really quick and maybe for a long time Therefore, it's important to keep your air as long as possible. I've never stopped the time how long I can do it, but we will see. I think 30 seconds like this can be okay, but it's really, really important to do the exercise like every day. This is the only way to improve training. Again. And. Okay. <laughs> really try this a few times and explore your belly with your fingertips. What you need to find is here, diaphragm. Please don't do it like this, okay? Not like this. Be careful with your belly and, and your body. <laughs> so when you do it, it's only like touching a little bit. And when you see the ribs coming out like here, you can go a little bit underneath, but not like, like this, okay? Be careful. Okay, <laughs> try this at home. We all need to stay at home right now. So this is the perfect tutorial for this week. So let's do this and have fun!